Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here with another quick tutorial. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you guys how to resolve if the deployment operation was blocked because the special profile deployment is not allowed error you are coming across on your Windows computer. And it further suggests that you can try logging out and logging back into the current account. So actually the first thing I would recommend doing would be to sign out of your profile or just completely restart your computer and see if that resolves the problem in itself. Otherwise, another thing we can try here would be to open up the SAR menu, type in regedit, so R-E-G-E-D-I-T. Best result should come back a reddish editor. You want to go ahead and right click on that and select run as administrator. If you receive a user account control prompt, go ahead and select yes. And now, before you proceed in the registry, I would suggest that you create a backup of it. So if anything were to go wrong, you could easily restore it back. And in order to create the backup, it is very simple. You just would go ahead and select the File tab and then Export. File name, I normally recommend naming it the date in which you are making the backup. Export range should be kept to all and save it to a convenient and easily accessible location on your computer. And once you've done that, if you ever need to restore back, you can just select the File and then Import option and navigate to the file location. So again, very straightforward. And also now we're happy to be ready to begin. So we're going to start by double clicking on the HK local machine folder. So go ahead and double click on that. Do the same thing now for the software folder. Same thing for policies. And then Microsoft, double click on that. And there should be a Windows folder. Go ahead and double click on that. And then there should be an APPX folder right under that. Go ahead and just double click on that one time. And if you need to pause the video, just take note of where we are. You can see up at the top of the screen here, each bank slash is a different subfolder we've gone under to get to this point. So feel free to pause the video, just take note of it. And now on the right side, there's going to be a D word value we're going to create and we're going to name it something I'm going to have in the description of the video. You guys can just copy from my description. It's going to be allow deployment in special profiles. No spaces in between any of that, but we're going to go copy that from the description of my video. Go over to the right panel here and right click in a blank area. Select new and then select D word 32 bit value. And like I said, this is going to be in the description of my videos. Just paste it in. So allow deployment in special profiles. Go ahead and hit enter and you can see it's spelled out here. I'm going to make the column a little wider and go ahead and double click on it. Set the value data to one. So delete the zero, type in number one numerically. So numerical one base should be hexadecimal. Go ahead and select OK. Once you're done with that, you can go ahead and close out of the registry editor. You will need to restart your computer for this change to take effect and that should be about it. So as always, thank you guys for watching this brief tutorial. I do hope that I was able to help you out and I do look forward to catching you all in the next tutorial. Goodbye.